Zelkova serrata, Japanese Zelkova. This is a tree reaching 60 to 80 feet high. It tends to have a very upright or vase-shaped habit. It's a member of the elm or the Ulmaceae family and has many similar characteristics to the elms. Its foliage is deciduous and alternate. The leaf shape is rounded at the base, oblong to ovate. Leaves are one and a quarter to two inches long, sharply serrate on the margins, and with acuminate teeth. There will be eight to 14 pairs of veins. The foliage will be dark green and rough in texture. The teeth will point forward towards the tip. The specific epithet serrata is referenced to the sharply serrate teeth. The leaves may look very similar to that of elm, but will be much smaller in size. The dark green foliage in the summer gives way to bronze or off yellow fall color. Fall color can be yellow, orange, brown, and possibly a deep red. Foliage is usually rough on the upper surface and glabrous underneath. Ornamental features of Zelkova serrata. These have a reddish brown bark with lenticels. With age, the bark may become gray brown and somewhat exfoliating, similar to Elmus parviflora, but less so. These produce a small kidney bean shaped droop, which ripens in the fall. The buds are ovoid in shape, somewhat acutish, and have many shiny brown imbricate scales. Buds are about a quarter inches long overall and usually stick out from the stems at upwards of a 45 degree angle. Cultural information for Zelkova serrata. These are hardy from zones four to eight and prefer full sun. They'll tolerate acidic to alkaline soils, pH is five to eight. Their native range is Japan, Taiwan, and Eastern China. Notes about Zelkova serrata. As a member of the elm family, these have been used as a substitute for the American elm since Zelkova serrata is resistant to Dutch elm disease. Although it has narrow branch angles, which can be a problem for splitting and decay, the timber itself is high quality and has been used to produce expensive furniture as well as in construction. In the wild, these can be found in alluvial soils along river banks and mountain streams, but it is also tolerant to dry soil conditions.